she's been singing a lot this morning. <laughs> we just got out of an appointment. She was singing in that appointment too. I wish I knew what she was singing. But um, yeah, so we are on our way to feed the ducks and then we're gonna eat lunch. And then we are going to go talk to the speech therapist some more. See kind of the visual of her results she got for her evaluations. We were supposed to see it on Monday, but uh, she forgot him at home. So we're gonna go today and do it. So we got out of the lunch, and lunch was pretty interesting because, <laughs> um, you know those really, really big wind turbine uh, propellers? Yeah, um, I don't know what this guy was thinking, but he tried to come off the interstate and he got himself stuck. <laughs> Him and his big wind turbine propeller, he got all stuck in. <laughs> Took him about 10 minutes, I think, and cops finally came out and helped him and he finally got over. <laughs> but <laughs> that was our entertainment for today. <laughs> For our um, appointment with the therapist um, so now I'm just gonna take Valeska over to this really this cool park and we're gonna play for maybe 20 minutes and then we're gonna go over to see results on Valeska's speech yay are you tickling Adeline <laughs> Oh, so I had that seat all hooked up and then my husband decided to unhook it. So I'm going to make him put it back in. But yep, <clears throat> go play at the park now. They enjoy playing the ducks. It is colder today than it's been all week. And um, I didn't realize that until we walked out of the house. We're in, you know, tank tops and shorts and it's windy and it's kind of cold. It's like 68 degrees and I'm like, ooh, but the sun is nice. So as long as we stay in the sun, there's no shade at the park, so it might be warm enough. Hopefully the, it's not hot. That wouldn't be fun. But yeah, so we're going to go play, and then we're going to do that, and then and the speech. And then we're going to go home and take a nap. <laughs> she can't get out of the box. doctors probably about a couple hours ago sorry it's been so <laughs> um, I got really hungry so we went and ate and then I had to go to the store and um, whew, okay doctor says I am now at a three I'm at a three guys yay I have progressed since last week and she said because this is my third baby um, lately I've been getting really really and I didn't I don't think I mentioned this on my update and I probably should have um it's just this last week has been really I might have I can't remember um really tight in my belly like I have absolutely no room for him anymore 
and I mentioned that to my doctor and she said because it's my third if I want to I can go ahead and instead of waiting the 41 weeks um, go ahead and schedule one for next week so I was like okay yeah I could do that <laughs> so um, but she also said because I'm at a three I'm a three centimeters and 90 percent of face she said because of that she thinks she's gonna see me this weekend we'll see <laughs> um, but we went ahead anyways kind of as a backup to plan for an induction on the 10th so uh, on the 10th anytime between now and the 10th Kale will be here so yay it does make me feel better now that I kind of know when it's about to oh, when it's about to happen <laughs> sorry I was having a contraction speaking of contractions um, yeah so even though she did that she asked me if I wanted my membrane sweet <clears throat> swept and I was like yes please because I'm done this achy and pain and um, she also said he was super low when she checked me he was like super super low he was right there which is why another reason why I've been very achy down there <laughs> um, but so she swept my membranes and ever since then um, I didn't really at first but now I've got like I can feel I, I can feel the contractions now and they're <laughs> they're definitely there um, I'm not going to think too much into it right now because the last time I had my membrane swept was with Valeska and I did have cramping afterwards but it went away so these are a bit worse than what I remembered with Valeska but because of that I don't want to think too much into these contractions so I'm gonna wait uh, for a while and if they get even more intense then I'll know because after hers she hers stopped after a couple hours and although it's been a couple hours and they're just now kicking into gear um, who knows <laughs> But she did say she might see me this weekend, so maybe she'll see me tonight. Who knows? Um, <laughs> but yeah, so that's my update. I Baby's still good. His heart rate was at 137. Um, I can't wait to meet him. But uh, that's, that's what I got from my update on the doctor. And I don't have to go back to the doctors now because Wednesday I will be, if I don't have him this weekend, Wednesday I will be having a baby. Yay! <laughs> Finally! Ah, there's a light at the end of the tunnel. Even though I didn't want to be induced. I said that many, many times. I did not want to be induced. I really want to go into labor on my own. Um, but we're using it as a backup just in case. Because it's... He's so big in there right now. And my belly is so small. People keep thinking I'm still like seven, eight months along. And I'm like, no, I'm nine. <laughs> I've only got a week left. <laughs> yeah, so it's a backup. It's a backup plan. Um, I'm still hoping maybe I'll go into labor before before then. Um, we will see. And here comes another contraction. <laughs> Alrighty, so that's my update for you. Yay! We have a we have an end date finally. We're not gonna go over 40 weeks. I don't think I could get any bigger. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm home. I have put the girls down. And now I'm just going to relax and count contractions. I've noticed since driving home, they've kind of tapered off a little bit. They're not coming as often as they were. So I'm almost assuming that these are going to end up being like they were with Valeska, where it's just kind of going to dwindle away. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. I'm going to relax and count contractions while I watch a movie. Why not? Got the girls down for a nap, so, and it's really gray outside. Gloomy gray. We were going to go to the pool, but I don't think that's going to happen. So, I will be keeping updated, or I will try <laughs> to keep updated if, if anything progresses on my Twitter that I rarely ever use because I'm, I'm not familiar with Twitter. But seeing as I don't post anything on the weekends except for on Monday... Um, yeah, I should probably, if things progress, I should probably do that. So that's where you can find baby updates. Um, otherwise, Monday. <laughs> we'll see you Monday. Till then.
this week, kale is pretty much the size you 